where first of all I want to show you how body the body silhouette interferes with how the cloth is going to act okay what I want to show you normally the points higher they are pretty close to the clothes but points that are let's say going in the direction of the gravity like this part right here it's going to get not that close to the hand as an example it's not that close comparing to this part that is touching the hand ah. this part here is touching the arm this part right here is not touching the arm an example here on males tend it's not like a rule but tend to be bigger and the female is like more and this ferment right here it's not a rule you can make all type of body that you want all the types of body that you want oh yeah but I want to show how this is going to interfere with how the cloth is going to react like here there is a button do you see the places that are getting closer to the bottom? It's just going towards it. Do you see it? All these parts. All of them. When I say all of them, it's all of them. That's the only main difference that I would say about them too. going to create another layer and add our beautiful uh-huh you get it uh-huh multiply remember you must press ctrl and out and put both together if you're in the middle of the process and you think oh no it looks so bad. What do I do? Remember, you're still going to add light, you're still going to add gradient, you're still going to add reflection. There are a lot of lots of things to do. Here, change our color to white. And then you start applying little by little. Okay, little 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 by little. So you're going to have a gradient happening here you know the places with more light get more details and places with less light receive less details back to color doge mode and we're going to apply that beautiful brush that I'm using right now giving credits to Sir Jerry Kolosov sketch brushes you can get those brushes for free on the internet 